Hey everyone, Brian with you from the Game Company. We are playing more Civ 6, continuing with our Catherine Magnificent campaign. And I was just looking at this as I was loading into the game. Like, how expensive is this dress? Are those like pearls? And then you got some sort of like ruby diamond thing that's freaking gigantic. Like, and then what, more pearls on your belt? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> we are definitely part of the 1%, man. We're we're in the elite. Uh, Alright, anyways, where do we leave off? I don't know, it's been a couple days. Um, okay, so Leventa was switching because China took that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We did start settling over here. We are completely trapped, and we started settling over here as well. Okay, and yeah, we flipped Hong Kong. Okay, okay, we did save after the last episode. Hold up. Yes, okay, just double checking everything. Uh, friendship expired, we're good there. So, yeah, defeated, yeah, 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 yeah. Wonders, temple, lighthouse, and Colosseum. And then era score, because we're trying to avoid that dark age, which I think is going to happen. Uh, then the other thing I wanted to look at is where are we at in diplomacy? So we're tied for first with one. Beautiful. Now, Petra. What? What are you doing? No. Yeah, build the Petra. Okay. Hopefully that hadn't been happening for a while. Um, also, I gotta move my keyboard. I had it bump back yesterday because I was eating at my computer, which is never a good idea. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, there was a comment mentioning that we need to build more old uh, God Obelisk because the extra faith early game is really important. And actually, the more I didn't really think about this, but especially with our current Golden Age, man, if we would have that in every city, it would be really, 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 really nice. Now, I think we actually have it pretty much built everywhere now. Yeah, we do have it built in almost every city, which is great because that's plus four. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That would be eight cities we would have it in, which would be quite nice. Now, I didn't think about this. Do you have an old god obelisk? Did your monument get upgraded? It did. Interesting. So the monument, if you take over the city, just becomes an old god obelisk. Now, if it flipped back, I would assume it would just be a monument. But if you conquer the city, you lose the monument. So that would only happen on a city flip, my assumption, right? Anyways, still, that's nice. Free four faith, basically. Uh, and yeah, we might as well go build you over here. Uh, could I buy it? Yeah, I could, but I don't really want to spend the money. Okay, so you... I think we need to put a city up here. Yeah, because we're not going to get the chance to do this later. I think we have to. Killer freaking campus holy site there. Huh. I'm just thinking... I'm thinking what tile I want to be on. Obviously here from the defensive standpoint, but I don't see us actually getting into war now anymore. I think we're going to be pretty assured of our safety. So I think we're going to go right there and hope to live. Now also, hold up. Someone mentioned, because we have the culture bombs right now. Can we culture bomb anything from Nazca? Uh, I think we did, because this wasn't ours, right? I think we culture bombed you back. We could also... No, I wouldn't be able to take it because it's adjacent to the city center. Uh, you're a theater square, which we could actually culture bomb the horses. Hold up. I actually want to finish that. We need to go and knock that one out as quick as possible. Forget the obel obelisk. Yeah. Yeah, we may want to chop, although, honestly, we should just go get the horses. Yeah, we'll go take care of that. Uh, and then we have you coming here. This is going to be a bit of a nasty city to settle in, but we'll be fine. Uh, get the granary first. Uh, I will go ahead and move Victor down there because that city, Cali, is going to have a problem. How did it go from negative three to zero? You know, I don't think I... Oh, that's the power. Okay. I hit zero instead of eight, and I freaked myself out because I thought that was the turn ending. I was like, <gasps> no, no, no. We're good. We're good. Now, that was far enough away. You're not going to get pissed, right? We did choose that correctly. Pretty sure we did. Pretty sure we did. So, we're doing a, a holy site there, or sorry, a theater a district there. What about in Hong Kong? We could grab the campus. Nah, well, uh, no, because they already started the theater square. Yeah. Yeah. And then the entertainment was right there. Okay, I'm just kind of trying to see if there's any culture bombing. 
Because we probably should have spent more uh, time trying to culture bomb. We, we took it. Uh, we're like, yeah, let's totally culture bomb. And then we just kind of forgot that that was the thing we're trying to do. But whatever. Okay, we'll just put you there for now. All right, trying to get my freaking game on here. Uh, just fortify. We are only one away from avoiding a dark gauge. Beautiful. I will take that. Make me happy. We also should sell our things off to get some money. Uh, not that I really need money, but then again, we're talking about buying obelisks, so maybe we should, but whatever. Leave me alone, man. Um, I'm tempted to buy more units. I really am, but let's start. Uh, I want the entertainment complex for sure, but let's get some ancient walls going. Just because we've yet to have them. Now, we still don't have roads up here. I thought we sent a trade route via here. Maybe I just went from Marseille, but I could have sworn we sent one this way. All right, Petra's eight turns away. Good. Good, good, good. Good. Let the dark side... No, let your hate flow through you. Something along the lines. It's been a minute. I need to watch the original trilogy. We rewatched episode nine, and I, I enjoyed it a little more the second time, but man, I'm just so disappointed for the sequel trilogy. I, I thought they could have done so much better, and I know I'm a typical Star Wars fan here on this, but I was very much like... I was okay with seven... Or sorry, uh, yeah, seven. I was okay with it, even though it was basically copy paste. Eight, I really enjoyed. I'm one of the few people that really loved eight, just because they did something different. I love that. Um, and I really liked the original idea for nine. Honestly, what nine turned into was just another copy paste, and I just hated it. And it's like, here's my biggest problem with it, is it's like we're really right back to where we began after episode six. That's, I think, my biggest issue with it, where it's like nothing happened. And I was thinking, like, they could have had the exact same storyline going with just some slight tweaks, and it would have been so much better. Like, imagine... Imagine if Luke Skywalker actually had like a generation of Jedi like imagine if the new order was coming in and instead of just you know Having to worry about one Luke Skywalker. They're actually fighting and killing a bunch of Jedi Which maybe it would have been too dark for Disney, but still that would have been freaking awesome See all these Jedi like fighting and you know um, trying to fight against the stormtroopers That would have been freaking cool But new 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 uh, we don't have Caravel yet, right? No Okay, government policies. We do have production towards wonders rolling. There's still nothing else we want except that. So, not really too concerned about any of this. We did avoid the dark age. Now the question is, can we get a golden age? What? What? What the hell? I have never been culture bombed by the AI before. What? But that's mine. <laughs> what? You can't do that. How does China get a culture bomb? Also, that's a desert tile. Okay, I guess that is. How does China get a culture bomb here? I'm trying to think. Is that a religious thing? Uh... Confucianism? No, that's Indonesia. China. Oh, they changed warrior monks so you get culture bomb. Oh, you know, I don't think I realized that. So, that's the founder belief though, right? I can't use that one. Is that the founder belief? No, that's not the founder belief, right? I can do that one. Oh, that's the wrong one. That, that, that Taoism. Yeah, no, that's... I can do that one, right? I think. I think. Huh. It would have to, like, I would have to have his religion. I'm just wondering, can we culture bomb and take our territory back? Speaking of which, while we're here, we need to go ahead and buy that so he can get it. Mm. I actually didn't need to buy that now. I'll look at that. Yeah, I should have bought you instead. I'm trying to stay away from Wuhan, man. Just don't want to mess with Wuhan. Freaking annoying. So you're basically just kind of chilling right now until we can get our settler up. Okay. Uh, your promise has been fulfilled. Good. Well, that's actually great. And then what did you do? Four tiles gained fertility. Dude, that's turning into a really awesome tile. Oh, dang it. Ah, mm, screwed over my freaking marsh. Dang it. We knew that was going to happen at some point. Although, honestly, putting a mine on it, it's going to be the exact same. 
So, all right, in the scheme of things, it's not terrible. So let's go repair. You blew up my fishing boats? Oh, come on. So let's repair, repair, and then two builds. And then we wanted a build here, probably? I mean, I really still need a builder down here because I need that tile, but... Because I really want to speed this up. Oh, you're not actually not going to finish in time, are you? Even if I do have that, so you're not going to get that culture bomb. Meh. Meh. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what we want to do there. All right, so with our alliances, let's see. How do we want to do this? We got to be very careful here. We probably want a cultural alliance, I think, with Germany. Or China. With China, we could keep settling down here. With Germany, Germany could settle here and jack stuff from us. Are we worried about Germany flipping us? Not if I have China. I think, yeah, I think doing China is probably our best bet. Okay, hi. Cultural lines. Open borders, and then pay me a bunch of money. Mm, hey, take some of this while you're at it. And pay me a bunch more money. 11 gold for 30 turns. Yeah, I mean, not going to complain about that. Uh, let's look at military here. Russia has the largest military. But, you know, I think I think for my own safety, let's, let's do it with Germany. <laughs> right? I mean, there's never a problem doing... Like, military lines with Germany, I think, is, is adequate, is acceptable. And then you'll have religious... Okay. We probably want to do economic. But I can't. Ah, dang it. We screwed that up. I want an economic with you, but I cannot. Scythia is the one I see, right? So Scythia, we can send a trader out to. So Scythia economic, that is going to be good. Because uh, we'll just have the water bonus as well. So we'll get some crazy amounts of money doing that one. And then I'll just do a religious with you. Whatever. Uh, we should be sending some more stuff here. And then, yeah, take more iron. Because I don't care. Oh, dang. 19 gold for 30 turns. Not bad. And then, hello. I can't do a science with you. All right. That's fine. Totally okay. Whatever. You want to pay me for both of these? You'll pay me 122 gold. That's it. For two of these. Okay, so you already have that. You know, I want to see something here. How much diplomatic favor does everyone have right now? 73, so Russia has the second most. I might actually want to try getting some of Russia's. Just because I want to force through what I have. I already sent you stuff. Dang it. Yeah. 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 Okay. We'll wait. Because remember, we we need... Mm, yeah. Mm. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. I need envoys. Let's go ahead and grab military tradition because we do want military training. So, military tradition's not going to give us anything. Military training does give us an envoy. Uh, we're not planning on fighting anytime soon, but sure. Okay, so diplomatic quarter is now giving us one diplomatic favor. So we should be making crazy amount of diplomatic favor right now. Two from embassies, two from delegations. Wait, is it once received? From a foreign civilization. So you have to wait for them to send you one. And then we're getting another envoy. We have two envoy now, and like no freaking city states, which is kind of annoying for the record. But all right, here we go. Hunza is now ours, which we wanted, so that's beautiful. Yeah, we were gonna actually switch you over, but there's no real need for it now. And then influence points per turn, spies reduced by one, and then plus two gold. I mean, it's not a bad building. It really isn't. I'm wondering how necessary. Freaking punk. I wonder how necessary it is. I think we take this tile back, right? Because it will be adjacent to my city center. I'm pretty sure we would just grab it right back. Um, hey, just go on auto explore because I could kind of care less. Although I should upgrade you to a swordsman just in case you randomly run across barbarians. But then again, maybe that won't be a problem considering 
this looks like a very tiny map that's mostly explored. Okay, we've taken a little too long here. Bravery. Is Let's get the move on. Um, so you're trying to get down here because there's not really much else we can do. I should send a troop over there to go explore. I should buy a scout. Yeah, and we still have scouts, so let's go do that. I don't have cartography, Brian. Gosh dang it. I actually can't even enter the water with you. Mm. <laughs> ah, whatever. Whatever. It's fine. It's totally fine. The walk got built. Okay. Okay. A little scared there. We just want to make sure we get the Petra. Yeah, so you're 3-2 again. So, whatever. Uh, do we need the extra clams? I think so. And by clams, I mean pearls. Wait, pearls are in clams. Right? That's a clam, right? My lack of loving fish. Yeah, that's a clam, right? And there's a pearl inside clams? Hold up. Hold up. Are pearls in clams? Or oysters? Although clams and mussels can produce pearls, they don't do so much uh, so often. Okay. Uh, as oysters, so they're uh, oysters. Okay, okay. Hey, we learned something today. Always a good day when you learn something. Uh, you completed the campus, so we did get a culture bomb. Don't know that that was a helpful culture bomb, but hey, sure, whatever. Theater Square, you're already working on. We probably want to knock that out. The shrine, like, I mean, yes, but we can live without it. So I need you to get a builder. We can build the Cahokia Mounds. Uh, what do they do for us again? C-A-H, correct? So, plus three gold. Cities get plus one amenity from their first one. And then they get plus one from their second one. And then plus one food for every uh, two adjacent districts. That's kind of bad. Provides plus one housing. So, one housing. So, essentially, one housing, one amenity, three gold. That's not terrible. Mm -mm. I'm not really going to have too many adjacent districts, though, but... Yeah, whatever. So, you just got built. We were going to go chop you. Gotcha. Thank you for putting notes down before uh, the end of the last episode, Brian. You're welcome, Brian. I know how you can't remember anything anymore. Shut up, Brian. I don't need you to talk crap about me. Hey, you know it's true. Hey, stop talking crap. <laughs> Sorry. We're, we're fine. We're totally, we're fine. We're not going crazy, man. No, that's just silly. Let's go straight for the chateau. Actually, we need to go straight for civil engineering. Yeah. We need to rush that out. Envoy. Oh, they changed that. That's every shrine building now, too. But it used to be plus two faith in the capital. Plus one gold in the capital. Yeah, okay. They changed the no one envoy. Huh. When did they do that? It's kind of bad, actually. Maybe... I, mm, I mean, it's bad early game. Because getting plus two faith early game, like, if you discover a uh, faith city-state right next to your capital, you can get so much faith early on and get that pantheon really early. And now it's a little slower. I wonder if that's why they nerfed it. I think I'm just going to hold on to the envoy. There's got to be more city-states left. Surely. <laughs> I love how they're all dead, which is so sad. <laughs> like, man... Man, man, man. Okay, you got three turns left on this diplomatic quarter. Uh, we must have just finished the government plaza building like right after this because we didn't get the free builder. I'm now realizing. Also, Emily keeps texting me. She's probably on a break. Uh, shop. That's fine. And then we can do lumber mills, right? I think lumber mills also give error score. Yes, we can. Cahokia mound? Eh, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, this will be fine. So did we have this mercury? I think Nazca had the mercury. I think we did actually jack that from them. I'm going to have to go back and look, though, to be safe. Uh, it doesn't matter which 2-2 I work, so. 2-2. Two -two. <sighs> All right, well, we got our first set of walls. Does that give you error score? It does not. I thought it did. It's fine. Doesn't really matter. Now, this should flip this tile, correct? Dang it, I thought it did. Yeah, I thought if it was adjacent to your city center, it would take the tiles. 
Huh. What really sucks is that is a freaking killer spot, man, for districts. Yeah, it really sucks we missed out on that. Also, this one. But really, the only reason I put a city here was to uh, keep the AI from being able to, like, Russia from settling over here. Mostly is just preventative. So, it's fine. We'll go work this stone, and I'll probably grab that lumber mill. We got the money. Yeah, you know what? Screw it. Let's do it. I should have... Nah, it didn't matter. God, man, I want a culture bomb. I want a culture bomb here, but I would probably rather do it here, because then I can get that tile and that tile, but eh, it's fine. Uh, obelisk, water bomb. Man, I wish the obelisk would culture bomb. That would be amazing, would that not? If you had a building that would culture bomb. Although, once again, that would have to be a district, because it wouldn't work. Whatever. What if you could pick where the culture bomb goes? Okay, now we're talking. <laughs> Now we're talking. Now we got something rather interesting. I think we are Cahokia mine mounding. They're not going to be adjacent to districts, but like gold housing. Then again, I mean, I want the lumber mill. We're going to have enough faith. Screw it. We're going to have enough faith. Let's let's just focus on the town. God, that's so terrible. Although the thing is, I think I wanted my triangle here, but I guess I could just do the triangle here. No, I think this was where the triangle was going to go. But without the river flooding, it's still kind of bad. So, sure. Sure. Our scout should be on his way. And by on his way, not really. So, you know what? I'm just going to send you up here, and let's just take you and send you over here. Because we shouldn't have any worries about uh, being declared on. So let's just keep advancing. Uh, yes, your embassy is welcome. Because that's extra diplomatic favor for us. We're making 11 per turn. Can we see what everyone else is making? Peter, natural disaster. All right. We got to win these, Brian. Remember, this is a little unusual. Because recently, I've just Petra been kind of ignoring this crap. Display Boom. Let's artist. go. Freaking Petra, baby. Not the best Petra. Not the worst. I mean... Kind of nice, really. <sighs> okay. How are we going to do it, though, against the deity? That's the problem. Okay, so it doesn't actually tell you how much. I think we have to actually do the builds. Or the... Aids. Oh my god, I'm the only one that said yes! <laughs> yeah, baby! Oh, I've never been happier in my life. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wait, I'm asking. Oh, man. Boom. Let's freaking go. Oh, it sucks to be the AI right now. So we really need to work on our income generation. Because we're going to have to win these aid requests here in the future. So, that means we're going to want these harbors popping out. Because we got some harbors. We got some popping harbors. And by some, I got one. I thought I built... I thought I had more. Maybe not. Apparently not. Dude, that's a nice little river spot. How many builds you got? You are working the six, right? Yeah. So I could go here on the quarry and get one extra production on the tile I'm already working slash lumber mill. Or I could go here and get one more food. I don't, I, I think we have enough food. I think let's go for the stone. And I'm, I'm guessing the mines are giving us plus two now in the quarries. If the lumber mill is giving us plus two, or is the lumber mill give you plus two by default? Oh, it gives you plus two by default. Interesting. So when do the mines give you pl there? Okay. Yeah, they're both giving you plus two. It's like when you don't know something and then you immediately figure it out. Okay, so we got ten era or ten turns to get five era. You think this will give us era score? Maybe. Maybe. I wonder if the XML files list out the era score for everything. Might be worth having. Okay, this is the fun. So, they are definitely going to vote against someone. They're going to vote uh, no amenities on someone. They always do that. 
And most likely they will do this one as well. So who is hated right now? Who does everyone hate? I mean, it's Ethiopia, but I don't know Ethiopia. So I can't screw over Ethiopia. Everyone hates Ethiopia. Everyone doesn't really like Germany either. By everyone, two people. Dang. And I can't do a trade deal with him yet. So we have to go, I think, global resources, correct? Um, we're looking for Germany. God, we need to meet Ethiopia. So Germany only has jade. Uh, spices. Spices would suck. Mm-hmm. We could do silver. Target Russia. We don't have any. Who was the one that was extraordinarily weak? Wasn't it Korea? Oh no, someone died. It was Indonesia, so she got wiped out. God, so they're definitely voting against Ethiopia, but we just don't know how Ethiopia is going to... Ah. So the problem is, A, this should be against Ethiopia, but we can't do it. So, who is Ethiopia hate the most then would be the question. Pretty much anyone. I think we focus on Germany. I think I think that's our only hope. This sucks. We're going to lose this one. Hmm. I don't want to do Jade and I don't want to do Spices. So we're going to do Germany, but we're just going to put a couple points in here because this is the one that's going to be a little worse. And we're going to go silver. Four and four. That's probably the best. I mean, okay, so we have two choices here. We could easily win one of these. I could put all my points towards one and definitely win it. If I go four and four, I'm at that point. Hedging my bet that we could get two. So I'm wondering if it's better to just guarantee ourselves one and just kind of hope we win the other one. Yeah, that's probably it. I think let's try this. So we're a little more likely to get at least one point. Trying to abuse the AI here. All right, we got one point, but we got the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> Wales. Gosh dang it. I thought about Wales. I did. I did. So diamonds or whales, we would have been fine with. And they both wouldn't have voted for it. So actually, never mind. So who had whales then? That was Russia and... Yeah, I thought about it because both Russia and China were not popular. That was a brief thought for me. Yeah, should have done it. Should have done it. All right. So court festival gives us culture tourism based on the number of excess copies of luxury resources. Oh, interesting. Huh. That would probably make it really easy to win a cultural game. Yeah, I think so. I'm not really going to worry about that right now. Uh, okay. So we're going to throw a campus down. Ooh. Ooh. No. 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 We're going to do a commercial hub because we need money. Yeah, we need money. So do walls. What's the builder? Five turns. Eh. And we don't need aid. We're winning, right? We just got to make sure we're positive there because, you know, that would be really crappy to <laughs> try being positive and then not being positive. All right. So we can actually build you now. Uh, Russia is going after someone. It wouldn't be me. So I'm not too worried about that. Uh, we'll finish the theater square. Give us some points, please. And then hello, Russia. Can I please, please, please find Ethiopia? What about? Yeah, see, I can't get through over here. I, had to, yeah, I can't get through there either. Urgh sucks 
Uh, who's this builder, by the way? You. Uh, yeah, you're fine. So, next turn, we're going to be able to get a builder here so I can go work on these resources. Uh, this was silver, right? Ah, so we would have screwed our own silver over, but, eh, whatever. Uh, purchase, builder, thank you, go here, thank you. Uh, we're still five turns away, man. Five turns away. How are we gonna do this? Not t quite sure yet. Yeah, not quite sure. Go theater square. Let's start knocking some of these out. How are we gonna get five, man? We finished our wonder. Uh, let's do a harbor. And then, yeah, you have the theater square queued up. Anyone else have any districts queued or need to be queued? I don't think so. Uh, you're at six. Now you already have one. La Rochelle hit five. Ambrose, we just are waiting. And then you're about to be four. And then, yeah, you're one. Uh, do we want to start a district here? You know what? Screw it. Let's go ahead and uh, lock down the harbor here. Just because. I really need to buy some of these tiles. Like... Uh, wasn't there one other tile we were looking to buy first? Before we spend money on something? No, because I think we grabbed that. I think we could grab that one. But I think we're better served by going for this 1-3. And then that cuts him off here. One, two. Well, he wouldn't be able to get there anyways. But still. Okay, okay, okay. Things are happening. Things are happening. A little slow, but it's okay. Uh, I do love the idea of building Cahokia Mound. Um, I'm gonna need Russia off my territory, though. Do you want to put one here? Yeah, sure, why not? Why not? What do I got? 31 minutes, okay. God, I need to meet Ethiopia. Arr. So are we gonna join a war against Ethiopia? Wait, that wouldn't give us error score. Wait, do you get points for those? No, right? Mmm... Hmm. Sure, make our people happy. Right, because we only got plus... We're at two right now, right? Yeah, so we didn't get points for the aid request. So if it was a war declaration, we wouldn't get points for voting for it. Okay, that's what I thought. We're not going to meet Ethiopia this way. <laughs> Dang it. And I guess we're going to wrap this episode up here. So hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, share your support. 21 turns away from getting uh, the Potato Palace. Now, this is going to be a problem. Because... I always call it the wrong thing, and now I don't know how to spell it. There you go. Patala. So, how much production is it? 10... Or 1,000. And what era is that? This is Renaissance. So we will get a boost. Which, speaking, we can actually switch off our Wonder Boost. Um, you currently have, what, 20 production. We will be doing an extra 15%. 20%. So that actually brings up a good question. I wonder if we should grab Monarchy then. Just so we can get the boost on it. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 turns. Yeah, I think we should grab Monarchy. Just so we can get another 15% boost. Wait, what? What? No. What? Why are you... No, I don't want this. My god. No, I just want Monarchy. Monarchy. Okay, I, I think I was hitting Theocracy. I think that's what was going on. So, anyways, though, without that, we're looking at 19 production. You're at 25, so Ambrosia might be a better town to build it in. Uh, one, two, three. So, we could build it right here. It doesn't have to be... It just has to be adjacent to a mountain, right? Just adjacent to a mountain? Oh, that's Mount St. Michelle. What? What? Where'd that one come from? Must be built on a hill adjacent to a mountain. So we can build it right there. So with 25, and then we have another 20%, which is going to be another 5. So we'll actually be at 30. So it's going to be 1,000 divided by 30. 100 is going to be like 3 turns. Well, let's just look at calculator. So hold up. 1,000 uh, divided by 30 is going to be 33 turns. That sucks. Yeah. We might need to chop. We'll probably end up chopping for it then. We got a couple... Yeah, yeah. We can move Magnus there, too. 
Speaking of which, we still need some more settlers. Yeah, let's go back there. All right, anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, everyone.